Welcome YouTube. The video you're about to see is a reaction video. It is a video of opinion. Nothing personal is meant toward the individuals in the videos. My volition uh, for posting these reaction videos is to look at these videos and critique them through the lens of correct sentence structure, communication, parse, syntax, grammar. Usually they are quantum grammar related videos and I'm looking for correct sentence structure knowledge here. And I'm also looking at the claims made in the videos through the lens of correct sentence structure, communication, parse, syntax, grammar. Now you may notice that I'm doing certain things with my hands. I am not making any secret hand signs or gestures. When one is doing public speaking, there's only so many things you can do with your hands. You can fold them, maybe put them on your hips, dangling lifelessly at your sides, put them in your pockets, hold them like this, whatever it is. I'm not making any type of signaling gestures, unless I do this, which means shaka. Keep in mind the information, the things that I'm sharing in this video are for educational purposes only, entertainment purposes only, nothing personal towards the individuals in the videos themselves. Thanks and enjoy. In this Coral Blade Grotto broadcast, I'm going to be looking at a video from a channel called For the Syntax, or you can see down here. And uh, it has 1,511 views. It premiered on October 24, 2021. So that's about, let's see, 21 to 22, year and a half or so ago. And it has in, in uh, whatever these squiggly brackets are, for the how to join the saving of our values and freedoms as a live, life, live birth claimant with the Canadian Constitution. What in the heck is that? It is not correct sentence structure, I can tell you that. No wonder they put it in brackets. It's quantum gobbledygook. <laughs> so I'm going to be taking a look at the video, Canada Constitution Meeting 3 Roll Call which is missing a couple tildes and has a particle of negation ing modifier right there. So let's see what's going on here. Oh, oh they put a tilde in there. So let's take a look at the grammar in the corner there. It says colon secretary on the Canada hyphen constitution hyphen treaty comma postmaster colon space Muriel hyphen meta uh, colon space Biggs period so secretary if you parse the word secretary you will find that the particle se when it appears before a hard consonant like the hard C is a particle of negation so they have a particle of negation in the word secretary that's modification on the Canada what is that if you try to read that backwards uh, in theory, it would say off the Canada Constitution Treaty by the Secretary. So forwards, it's on the Canada Constitution Treaty, but backwards, it's off, meaning completely a different thing. So therefore, the facts do not maintain the same value forwards and backwards. There is no mathematical interface. Quantum gobbledygook. Just to make sure I get this correct. So this is Secretary on the Canada Constitution Treaty, Muriel hyphen Meta colon Biggs. So in today's meeting, I want to bring greater closure on the vital importance and opportunity that we have as live birth claimants in Canada. Live birth claimants. That's interesting that she's using that term live birth claimant. I'm familiar with the term live life claimant but live birth claimant. Friends and neighbors, if you're watching this right now, you <laughs> were a participant in a live birth and you have a claim to that. That's a given. So why is she using those particular terms rather than live life claimant? It's interesting.
the health and personal freedom of our fellow life birth claimants in Canada and around the world, along with our fellow mankind all over the world, are under attack. With the claims in our Constitution and in its solitary position as the correct Constitution of our country, we are in a unique position. And I completely disagree with what she just said. I've seen the Canada Constitution. It is not correct. It does not have correct grammar on it. And I will show that. So I'm going to take you through real quick here a couple things about the Canadian Constitution here. You see right here they have the uh, closure to the flag is above the flag. The closure to something would come after it, not before it. How can you give closure to something before it's happened? <laughs> and then we have incorrect positionals here. We have in the which when you read it backwards, become out, within. What's that backwards? Of out? None of this is correct. And then the spacing, look at the excessive spacing here. Uh, and then we have particle of negation and contract. Contra is a particle of negation. That is why I hyphenate, C-O-N hyphen T-R-A-C-T. So let's see what else here. Uh, what is this? So with all the excessive spacing, then we have in italics, Canada Post Corporation. We have Vasily's name, forward slash location, and then it would be nothing because italics are off the page. Throwing everything into adverb, verb, adjective, pronoun, babble. Oh my goodness. See, this is saying, this is giving what a position is for, of, with, by, in, as, on, within. So how would that be backwards? If for is congruent with by, of is congruent with with, what's congruent with in, what's congruent with as, what's congruent with on, within, so on and so forth. For is cause, of is concern, with is possessive, by is authority. What's in? What's as? What's on? What's within? They're adding to it. So you have to account for that mathematically. The mathematical interface is very simple. 1 plus 2 equals 3. 3 minus 2 equals 1. How do those fit in there? So many particles of negation. Uh, and that's just the first page. So I'm not going to do the whole thing. I've seen enough to show me that whoever wrote this does not have closure on the grammar. And it's just basically all quantum gobbledygook of making big changes for ourselves. Change is modification. Modification is per perjury. Why do you want to make big changes? Why do you want to make big perjury, Muriel? Our life with claimants of the world and possibly setting the tone for our fellow mankind around the world. I feel as Canada Constitution citizens, we can take the solutions that the Postmaster General of the world and co-Postmaster General of Canada Russell hyphen J colon gold brings forward for us and we can set the example for our fellow life birth claimants with our correct performance of these solutions. In order to make this possible, we need 150 life birth claimants. 150 life birth claimants. All right, friends and neighbors, I just took a moment to try and find out why they're using that number, 150. Uh, you can see in my notes here from Director's Campaign, uh, November 2nd, 2015, uh, from Colin David Ivan Colin Miller, he said that one person is an opinion, two people is certification corporation, Three people, authorization. Four people, class action. Sixteen people, policy change, county level. Three hundred fifty people, ballot. Five hundred people, 
Public Ass Office 36,000 uh, Federal Policy uh, U.S. So I don't see 150 on there anyway. So, but I mean, you can make any type of number you want, whatever you need, I guess. Maybe there's a monetary uh, quota that they want to reach. In our roll call log, who are citizens of Canada, whether you live here now or not, and naturalized citizens of the Canada. I also want to go through the instructions tonight on the Constitution Joinder meeting, so that uh, Joinder method, pardon me, so that we are all on the same page and those that may miss the meeting have a reference to go to. So the first qualification for your Joinder on the Constitution is that you have a claim of the life from an authorized source, and you can find those sources on lastflagstanding.com. From an authorized source, which, friends and neighbors, I ask you your forgiveness for the language I'm about to use, which is complete and utter bullshit. I will leave a link up there somewhere to a director's party where full colon David hyphen Wynn, full colon Miller, and colon Russell hyphen J colon Gould are both there when David says, do not send us your live life claims. And then he invites people to uh, see his book <clears throat> where he has a live life claim template for free. I mean, the book was 200 bucks. I don't, you know, some people are selling it for three now. But I mean, you get this or you can get someone who has a copy. You can get a live life claim template back then. I wouldn't recommend using this because it's not correct grammar, but the point I'm making is that David and Russell were inviting people to make their own claims of the live life and not to send it to them because they're the authority of their own construct. Let me flip it around and say that you are the authority of your own construct. You can create your own claim of the live life as your own authority authorizing it. You don't need anyone else to do that. But then when David passed away, his student... Russell took over, tried to take over everything, modified everything, classified everything, put everything behind a paywall and have people like that out in front trying to get you to believe that you have to have authorization from him to even have a claim of the live life, which again is complete and utter bullshit. And I don't know how people like that can live with themselves. Forward slash grammar hyphen teachers. If you do not have a claim of the life and you want to join and you are a citizen of Canada, go to livelifeclaims.com and follow the instructions there to get your claim of the life. Let's take a look at this grammar right here, friends and neighbors. For your path of the correctness is with the start in this now space with the colon Muriel hyphen meta colon Biggs. So let's take out the colons and stuff in the Muriel meta Biggs name and try and read that backwards. It does not end with an authority, so there is no mathematical interface. And the positional in is not correct. So it would be something like of the Muriel out this now space because what's congruent with in? Out. Out this now space is of the start, that's wrong because a possessive must follow the verb. So it's complete and utter quantum gobbledygook. You can also go to Last Flag Standing and you can find that there are two other authorized places to get your claim of the life. If you know someone who wants to join on the Constitution and does not have a claim of the life, you can send them to Russell's website at lastflagstanding.com and also livelifeclaims.com. We're also putting the contact information and website into the chat and possibly on the screen. So to get yourself on the Canada Constitution, send a message to me at livelifeclaim at gmail.com. Make sure you put the word constitution in the subject field. That way I can right away know. Colon subject hyphen field. 
SUB is a particle of negation. My goodness. <laughs> that you're, you're wanting to get onto the Constitution, and I can put you in a separate group right away. I'm starting a database, so your name will go in there, and right away we know that we need to watch for your next step. And as soon as that comes in, I'm going to send you a message, and it will be a link to the very instructions that we're going to go through today. And We want to keep it short. It's not going to be really long and drawn out. They have gone through some, medic some modifications since they wrote them about a week. They have gone through some modifications. Changes modification. Modification is perjury. So Muriel and the gang are all about modification. So that explains all the mistakes in their grammar. So if they're about modification, as she just said, I'd have to say that these mistakes are on purpose, which is very interesting. Because oh, I review and check and review and check again, and I find there's always corrections and improvements that can be made. So, True. Um, my apologies to anybody who had any struggle with the first uh, version or two. The first version or two of the template she's talking about was sent to me in 2017 by Russell J. Gould. Mistakes all over it. They use the same one. There's still mistakes all over it. So I'd like to go straight to the instructions from here, and we'll see um, how much time we have at the end of the meeting, and maybe we can take a few questions. And I just want to welcome you all. I'm really, really grateful to see the, the number of people that we have. And, um, you know, if you know somebody who can't make it, just let them know that this is recording, and, and we'll have it up for them. So... So by the end of the instructions, you should have a document that looks like this. The first page of the Constitution, which is your page zero. And then you're going to have page 10. And then your claim of the life. And your claim of the life is only one side. So let's start back at the beginning. And we'll review what we're going to do here. You're going to put a stamp on the front page in and among the other stamps. Where it goes doesn't matter. You can cover up the other stamps. And when that stamp is in position, put your autograph, your correct grammar autograph, write your... Let me see some of these names in here. We got Muriel, we got... Mari Shapka, I know that name. Gordon's in there. Uh, live birth claim number there. Gordon Schiller. And then fingerprint so that you cover both Schilling the numbers. Schilling for Russell. <laughs> and the stamp. And Sorry. the paper. And then on the back of that sheet, you see there, you put your autograph Ooh, and your fingerprint. I'd underline that. The next page, page 10. Make sure you skip that line at the top there because that has a name under it. And you're going to go to this one here where there's an, it just says claimant and you're going to put your name there in correct grammar and your fingerprint and then you're going to go ahead as this citizen friends and neighbors how would you read that backwards there are four positionals four of with and by four is congruent with by of is congruent with with where does as fit into that how would you even oh my goodness and then you have contract contra contradictory Contra is a particle of negation. They got particle of negation all the way down the page. No track, no track, no track, no track, no track, no track. Oh my goodness gracious. And write your life birth claim number there. Don't worry if you go no, over the thank end of you. the line. You couldn't you pay me a million to. dollars to be on this. So the mm -mm. back of that page is going to be blank. And then here's the last page. This is your life birth claim. And you've done the front side. Now you're going to turn it over, and you're going to put a stamp, and your fingerprint, and your autograph. Wow. If you would like uh, a wealth of data and knowledge regarding how to create your own live life claim, I'm going to put a link up here to a mini class that I did giving details on how one would do that, uh, giving you closure on it, okay? As I said before, with maintenance of rule one, rule equal, when you present a problem, you have to present a solution. 
Otherwise, it's the sound of one hand clapping. This is the problem. I'm presenting a problem to you, and the solution would be that video that I'd link to up in the uh, starboard side corner there. And we're going to take these three pages. We're going to stock them together. And we'll clip them together. And we're going to take our glue. And we're going to go up here to the top. Is she really going to show how to glue this? Oh put glue. God. Glue and glue. And it should all hold together. I like to use glue and I like to use some pretty maritime you're ready to put ribbon. it in the mail and send it to me at the mailing location that you're going to find in the instructions. Next, these pages now. Wow. Mail library location in a box. Hmm. So, 2017, 229, Fort Worth. None of those. Wow. Quantum gobbledygook. Now, as a bonded document, are sent to me. And please do try and write it just as you see here. Yes, right now I'm in Texas because this is where the Syntax Learning Center is being built and we're working on it here. So that's why I'm here. And I actually checked with Chief and asked him if it was okay for things on about Canada to come here. And he said, yes, it was fine. He also gave me this as how you send it. So just so we all know that, that Chief... Chief. Is that your nickname, Chief? I don't know. Colin Russell J hyphen J colon Gould. If... You would like to get closure on correct sentence structure communication, parse syntax, grammar. If you would like to finish your training and learn the grammar with correctness, with the correct mechanics, not like what you've written here, but correct mechanics, you can contact me at jasonmatthewg17 at gmail.com and I'll set up a 10 to 15 minute video consult where you can ask me whatever you want to and I'll do the same and we'll see if this is something that you really want to do. Uh, because if this is what you're teaching people, I don't know what you're about, man. Has had hands-on involvement in what we're doing here, okay? And then if you would, after you've got it in the mail and you've got that receipt, send me a nice clear picture of it so that I know that it's on the way. And that, that is another thing I mark in the database is that you put it in the mail. Okay. It is for Canada, unfortunately, at this time. This is this is what we're working with, but it's <laughs> unfortunately. That's the truest thing she said so far in this whole video. This is unfortunate that they're peddling this quantum gobbledygook. It's not the only one that will happen, depending on what happens here, because we can set the tone, we can set. We can get this, <laughs> I don't know how to say it, but just this is a, this is an opportunity of a lifetime. It really is. Why is there a need of 150 people? It has to do with uh, we want to make, what do you need in five people? We need five people per, pro per province and territory to be able to go, to, to go and stand as a <laughs> class action. Thank you, Samuel. <laughs> they say class action. Is that what I said? earlier if you remember do you remember viewer was it was five class action four people is class action Four people, class action, right out of David Wynn Miller's lips, a director's campaign, uh, November 2nd, 2015, not five, four. <laughs> That's the word. That is what we're after, is a class action suit, okay? And we need five people or more. So if we have 150 people, we're 
counting on having five people per province and territory. Awesome. All right. Well, um, we do record the meet. The meeting is being recorded, and we do record the chat. And we'll. Well, that's about enough of that. You may or may not notice I've been drinking out of this cup. This cup comes from my absolute, my wife and I's favorite coffee shop in Cleveland, Ohio. It's called uh, Rising Star Coffee Roasters on West 29th Street in Cleveland. Best coffee shop over there. Highly recommend you check it out. No, they didn't pay me to say that. I just like to put, st I just like to support stuff that I use and that I like. And so I'm just giving them a shout out. Bottom line, in my reaction to, to this stuff, I know there's a lot of people that uh, buy into this, that have spent money. Matter of fact, I, I have a couple people that their live life claims from them are not correct grammatically. They're not correct mechanically either. There's no witnesses on the live life claim. And they've paid money for it. And they've contacted the Syntax Learning Center wanting to get their money back. And they have trouble doing that or the Syntax Learning Center never replies to them. So I would just caution you, friends and neighbors, if this is something that you're with the volition of being involved with, it's very similar to a cult. So caveat emptor. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to learn correct sentence structure, communication, parse, syntax, grammar, contact me at the email address listed at the bottom of your screen. I will set up a 10 to 15 minute video consultation between you and me. You can ask me whatever you like, and I'll do the same, and we'll see if this is something that uh, you're prepared to commit to. If you'd like to support the channel, click on the Join button underneath this video. There are two tiers of membership. Uh, the second tier has access to exclusive content not available to the public. Once again, thank you for watching. Uh, hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Turn the notification bell to all so that you don't miss any of my premieres because I do post on a very consistent basis. There are over 500 correct sentence structure videos for here you to study on this channel my gift to you my fellow mankind thank you again and i'll see you in the next one